friends welcome back to the class i am bhuvaneshri and today we shall be discussing about me and my computer before that let's learn how to on a computer first we are supposed to switch on the power switch then we are supposed to switch on the main switch of a ups or a generator then switch on the cpu then the monitor should be switched on then a screen appears a blank screen and that is what is our working windows now let's study about why do we need computer computer is a machine as you all know it's an electronic device that learn that runs on electricity or current supply why do we need it we need it because it makes our uh, work faster and easier it also helps us to do our homework presentation maintain our records apart from that we can play games in it we can listen to music we can do all sorts of calculation we need now let's study computer versus brain computer runs on electricity and it's a non living thing but human brain does not need any electricity it needs oxygen food and water and also it's a living thing computer works faster based on our input and output but human brain also works faster but not as compared to computer human brain can get disturbed mentally and physically while computer doesn't get any tiredness or it doesn't be disturbed let's study about the extra features of computer that is how and all computer helps us we will need calculator to do calculations but when there is a computer we can do it very easily scanning and printing has become a very easy task because of computer and also the computer shows us date time event here everything and all the information it also lets us messages to the people in other parts of the world also we can use this action and reach to people very instantly editing and sound recording can be done easily playing games also is easy in computer also it lets us draw and paint so these are the pictures that signify the same let's have a recap today we learnt about why do we need a computer extra features of computer and also we learnt about human brain versus computer and also the steps to switch on the computer that's all for today's class students i hope you really enjoyed learning this thank you